Hey friends and welcome back to another YouTube tutorial here on our channel putting up the pompons I am Shantae and in this tutorial I installed the 613 36 inch long faux locks and I added some curls in there so I'm gonna tell you about the inspiration behind this style how I achieved it the hair that I use and we're gonna also talk about the longevity of this style so let's go ahead and get straight into it now, of course, before I go any further, if you are new to my channel, do not forget to hit that subscribe button. Come join the family. We would love to have you. And to all of my returning subscribers, hey, Bessie, hey, mama, hey, friend, hope you are being safe and blessed as always. What video are you doing? Of my hair. All right, y'all, so now that we have the formalities out of the way, so in this tutorial, I have found like this TikTok or this lady was doing uh, faux locks on this um, woman and she did more curls or like kind of half and half. It was like half curls, half locks. And it kind of piqued my interest because I love styles that are different. So I'm gonna play the video right here so you can kind of see what I'm um, trying to achieve. Now she called them uh, Nubian hippie locks I believe that was what she uh termed them and her handler's name is um Sabrina's beauty so I, I just I thought it was interesting now um look somebody else had reposted her video saying you know hey this is a new like different something different because we're always looking for something different and innovative when it comes to a black women hairstyles so um somebody reposted it and the comments were they were not passing the vibe for me a lot of people were just like yeah that's too much hair you know that's just gonna be tangled and I believe they asked would you wear it for vacation I'm about to go on vacation and a lot of the girlies in the comments was just like hell no this ain't gonna work to me it was just like fun and it was giving me vacation vibes like it was giving me like on the beach wind blown in my hair oh so i decided to do it anyway now i i do plan on tweaking it there was some things that i did not particularly care for in the style that she used or did all right so i'm gonna voice over the rest of this video so here's the hair that i purchased off of amazon i'm going in with this blonde ocean wave crochet hair and then these are my locks that i use of course everything will be linked down below Below on my Amazon storefront where you can purchase and shop the pictures as well as all the products that I use so I'm starting out with my hair using the leave-in by pretty strands and then I'm also using some gel so my parts are nice and clean at least as clean as I can get them because it is hard trying to part your own hair Pretty much did the pattern where I did locks and then I did a corn roll for my crochet, then locks and then corn roll for my crochet. I didn't want to go from like one end of here and then come over here and end my braid because then I'll have like a big bulky ass piece. So I made sure I kind of like started on each end and then just met in the middle back here. <clears throat> so there you can see where it meets and then we're going to take them and pretty much crochet it just like that. All right, voice over me again. So I apologize y'all. My microphone is acting terrible during this recording. So I have to come in and kind of just show y'all and talk about what I'm doing as well. So all I'm doing is taking those two plaits, like I mentioned before, and I'm just crocheting them down. I'm not sewing them down or anything. I feel like just crocheting them in between or interlocking them is the easiest way for me. And then the rest of that hair is going to be individuals for me to do a regular lock. So this is my braiding pattern that I have. As you can see, I have locks right on top of the crown of my head. Then I have that corn roll for where we'll do the curls and then another set of locks Then another corn roll to do my curls and then the very back is locks again that very last row So I pretty much just kind of did like a you know switching it up pattern where it's kind of mixed in so we can have like half locks half curls That was my original idea and then I became a to, to have some problems with it. I went ahead and installed all of the locks because I felt like the locks was probably the easiest part of this entire style. So the curls are going to be last, but I'm gonna show you guys how I attach the lock. So I've seen this on TikTok plenty of times where people leave about an inch to two inches of space from the root. So you don't have like this big knot at the root of the braid when you're trying to wrap the hair. And then I unraveled my hair just a little bit right until I came up to the knot where the crochet hair is. And I I just braided my hair with it so I split my hair into two and then I used the lock as my third strand and I tried to do it as tight as possible because I didn't want it to go too far down the lock because I felt like if I had the hair longer then I that was going to require me to wrap more let me tell you something let me tell you something this hairstyle has gotten on my hot damn nerves okay 
So the hair I originally had for the the curly pieces, the hair I was using was was ass. So that hair I won't I won't even recommend. I ended up paying a visit to my local beauty supply store so I can purchase some hair to wrap my locks in. The hair that I had was the Passion Twist Water Wave and I just did not like the way that felt. And then this is the hair that I'm gonna go and use for my curly parts of this hairstyle. It is by Made Beauty and it has this like natural texture feel to it. And I think that's what I like the most about it, but it's only 20 inches, but we're still gonna make it work. So right now I'm gonna go ahead and wrap my locks with this new hair that I have purchased. And I also have a link for this on my Amazon as well. It's not the same brand, but I have used the brand on the Amazon before, just not in the color 613. I used it in the color 2, but it's still really good hair and it'll do what you need it to do for the locks. And I like that it matched the texture of the soft locks and it just blended in seamlessly. The water wave hair was just a little too frizzy for me and it was just too soft. I don't know. It just wasn't working. So I was running into a lot of dilemmas with this style because I really just did not know what to do. Um, in the tutorial, she just really just shows you a glimpse of what the style looks like she doesn't talk about it nor does she give any details about what hair she's using so a lot of this was trial and error for me I'm now gonna move on to doing the curl part. So I ended up installing locks throughout my entire head because I was really just getting fed up with the curly part of this style that I was just gonna just be like, you know what, never mind. I'll just do all locks instead. So that's why there's locks on the part where there should have been curls, but I decided to kind of mix it. So I, I'm gonna keep the locks where they are and pretty much where you see all those gaps is where I'm going to install the curls so I can have a more fuller look, I guess. So I'm taking just a strand out of the pack and I split it oh my gosh it was so much more easier the hair I was using before was tangling something terrible split, splitting it apart just made it ended up in knots and I ended up wasting an entire pack on that first hair that I tried a waste of my freaking money but the made beauty hair was awesome it wasn't tangling there was no no issues with it I did the invisible um knot method to get the hair to attach to my corn roll and I loved it it worked out great this is exactly what I wanted all right I finished adding the curls we got a lot more fullness here now on the sides now I'm moving on to the next section of locks and I'm gonna show y'all a more close up look on how I did the locks. I will say that the wrapping part of the locks can be a little tedious because you have to kind of like have a good grip on the hair and then like just, I don't know, you have to be comfortable with doing the twisting method and the wrapping and keeping the hair attached. I, it, I found that I was uh, having a little difficulty with it, but it just took some time and some practice. And then with the hair being 613 and my hair is black, I wanted to make sure that I was wrapping my entire hair. I didn't want to have no like peekaboo spots in the locks or anything like that. Um, so it just required me to like take my time and just move it as slow as I can to make sure that I did it correctly. I did not use any nail glue to secure the locks I just palm rolled them and they stayed in place with this hair I didn't have to worry about that now I'm going in with the curly hair again again as you can see I crocheted those locks onto the entire corn roll and I'm just taking the curly hair and going in between each lock I'm doing the invisible knot method and that's just where you take one strand of the hair and loop it through twice instead of taking both strands and looping it through twice I take only one strand of the hair and so this is what it's looking like I'm checking to make sure I don't have any gaps back there and if I do I just take a few more pieces of curly hair to fill it in so this is the next day I have finished styling everything the curls look great the locks look great I'm really starting to fall in love with it but remember I mentioned that the curls were a little too short they were only 20 inches and my locks are 36 so all I did was just take some curly hair and add it down the shaft of the locks now I only did it to the locks that I had to wrap myself the locks that were just crocheted in I did not bother adding the because I didn't want it to be too much curly hair and to me I felt like that was like a great median where I only crocheted the hair into the locks that were wrapped now I'm going in with some lot of body foam just to kind of calm down the frizziness of these curls I do and I will be expecting some frizz from having this curly hair in the locks but it is the look that I wanted and I'm going to tolerate it until it's time for me to take it out
Um, it took me two days to style this because I, um, it took me a minute to kind of get my footing as far as what hair to use and you know, that was a whole dilemma. Um, but I think it'll, it'll work for vacation. It will absolutely do its job when it comes to me being on vacation. Um, in all, I used three packs of locks and two packs of curls, giving me a total of five packs of hair in my head, which is about the, the usual you would use doing any kind of crochet style, anywhere from five to six packs of hairs, but it's gonna give you a full look. This is definitely a fun summer hairstyle. Absolutely a look, and that is what the purpose of this style was supposed to do. So I give it an A plus. It's doing what I need it to do. It's giving me a look for vacation. It's different. And you know, I know I'm gonna turn heads in it. Pretty much concludes this video, guys. I, um, if you, of course, any of the hair that I mentioned or products that I mentioned here on my video, you can purchase all of those products through my Amazon storefront, which is located down below in the description box. Just click that link and you can shop the pictures, the photos that we post on the Amazon storefront, and it gives you a list of everything that is available on Amazon that you can kind of click and purchase. Since this video was just so long winded, I am going to do a separate video on how to style these logs I'll be showing you five ways that I plan on styling my logs on at vacation I will have some practical hairstyles and I have some overtop ones because y'all know I gotta be dramatic so if you want to see that video it'll be posted the next day after this original one Do not forget to hit that like button and share this video to all your social media platforms help us get 10,000 followers here on YouTube that is our goal for 2022 thank you guys for joining us on another video be blessed and be safe.